we are sophisticated, and we now know that there are moderate Arabs. You see, there are moderate Arabs today. In fact, there are even moderate terrorists. Presumably, kill Jews moderately. The the essence, the epitome of the moderate Arab is King is King Hussein of Jordan. Of course, very very moderate. I don't know why he's moderate. He's short. King Hussein of Jordan. The moderates. He had the occupied lands of 1967 from 1949. Why didn't he proclaim a Palestinian state? Why didn't the world say Palestine? Where was Rita Hauser and her four friends who rushed off to Stockholm for a Swedish massage with Arafat? Where were they then? The moderate, the moderates, Hussein, the moderates. He had Judea and Samaria, the West Bank. He had East Jerusalem, and he went to war. What was bothering him in then? If someone has East Jerusalem and he goes to war, one doesn't have to be more than a sophomore, logic major, to know that he might want West Jerusalem. <laughs> Then West Tel Aviv, then West Haifa. Of course, that's what he wanted then. But more to the point, that's what he wants today. There are no moderate Arabs. There are two kinds of Arabs. There are smart ones and stupid ones. The stupid ones say what they mean. Throw the Jews into the sea. Wipe out Israel. George Chabad. The smart ones mean exactly the same thing, but they've gotten smarter. After losing four, four wars, they've learned the Jewish secrets. If you say nice things about Jews, they'll throw money at you, or the Sinai. There are no moderate Arabs, and more to the point. It's not the occupied lands of 1967. It's the occupied lands of 1947. It's the Jewish state of Israel that is the obstacle to peace. So if you want peace, I have an instant peace plan. No problem. Instant peace, instantly. Shalom yad. Peace instantly. Give up Israel. I guarantee you peace instantly. You want that? Not I. Zionism did not come into being for peace. Know that it came into being for a Jewish state, and hopefully with peace. But peace or no peace, a Jewish state. And if you think that a Jewish state is won by writing a check, you're in in the wrong world. A state is won by blood and by sweat and by sacrifices. And if people can't take it, then get out and let other people that can take it. Run the state.